yeah, so I've got another bike. <laughs> <laughs> I wasn't going to go for this bike. This is a Cy Russia, uh, and it's a, called a Komoda. I think you have to be careful how you say that. Yeah, and how do you pronounce this? Uh, Cy Russia, Cy I, Russia. that's how I'm doing it. Okay. I'm, joined, I'm joined by nephew Liam. Hello again. Who's going to help me put it together. I'm probably going to put, put it together, aren't yes, you? Yes, please. Yeah. <laughs> I like doing it. <laughs> so, um, yeah, so we're going to get it open. We're going to have a look at it. And we're going to go for a little ride, hopefully by the end of the day. We'll let you know how we get on with it. People always ask how much it weighs. It doesn't actually say on the website how much it weighs, but the box weighs 35 kilos. The net weight is 30 kilos. So I imagine that's the bike. And we've got a blue, haven't we? Got a blue one. Yeah. They just left it unticked as a surprise. Yeah, <laughs> that's right. <laughs> Yeah, a lot of people seem to have gone for the orange one, but uh, no, we've gone for the blue, just for a change. Yeah, we've had to do this outside today because Jenny didn't want us <laughs> doing it in the kitchen. <laughs> one time is enough. Yeah, you end matches. up with lots of bits of paper. Oh. You all right? Well, yeah, you broke I'm my scissors having, already. I'm having a scissor malfunction. <laughs> Quick <What> malfunction. <laughs> Come on, I'll fix there it. There you go. <laughs> okay. Straight away, that's the toolbox. That's the toolkit, isn't it? Yeah, this was quite good, I thought. That's a good one as well. Yeah, and there are instructions in here, you know. Yeah. Well, see how cool I am if I can do it without. <laughs> that's the throttle. So. That's a thumb throttle, isn't it? Thumb yeah. throttle. So straight off the bat, this is restricted, isn't it? Yeah. Fifteen point five miles per hour in the UK. I'm just going to put this over here. Uh, whereas if you want to unlock it, I looked and it'll do 28. Uh, 28 miles an hour? Yeah, yeah, not legal in the UK, but no. legal if you're private owned. Not private owned land, is it? No, not on the road. Not on the road, road, yeah. Battery, similar and look, to the other. And look, this comes with a UK plug. It does as well. That's good. Does it have a little LED indicator on it? Yeah, little LED yeah. indicator so you know okay, you're charging. Little, use the manual for the battery charger. Won't that be plug it in and connect it? Yeah, yeah. <laughs> Pretty self-explanatory there. Two pedals, built-in reflectors, they're good. It's quite yeah. small, actually, nice. Yeah, are they plastic? They're plastic Compact, aren't they? yeah. Yeah, okay. And a piece of resistance. Yeah. A pump. That was a surprise, wasn't it? We saw there was a pump with it. That's that's good. It's quite good because a lot of people don't have one on hand. No. It's not, you know, it's not metal. It's not amazing, but it'll do the job. What is we'll it? we'll use it. Yeah. Yeah. See what it's okay. like. And a spanner for 15. Oh yeah. Inch spanner for the inch spanner. pedals. Okay, that's good. And instructions. And an EPAC sticker. Is that the instructions? Oh, right? well, the it's man no, it's battery manual. manual. These are the instructions. Okay. So I've just I've a looked quick at look. these already. Now, if you struggle putting things together, you can't really get better than that. No, no. That's a very, very Take good it out detail. Of the box. <laughs> yeah, okay. It's actually really good. No, it's good. I like to think I don't need these though. <laughs> so how wrong can you go? <laughs> yeah, exactly. Until two Back minutes my later. Last video. <laughs> That's well packaged again. Yeah. You know, it's quite a far way for it to go, so everything's really mod in guards. there. Front mod guard. Looks like you put that on with the wheel again right this time. Uh, I'll be the seat under there, I'd imagine. Wheel's stuck in here, so we'll snip that. One. The next one. Two. Any more snippies? It's actually connected to the side of the box, if you look. Yeah, so yeah. unlike last time, oh, and there, unlike last time, not only yeah. is it cable tied to the wheel, yeah. But it's really yeah. stuck in there well. Okay, you can come off. Our favourite part. Get the wheel. Out. wheel. It gives you an idea how big the wheel is. So these are 20 inch wheels, aren't they? Yep. Four inch tyre again. Fat tyre. Yeah. And a very striking blue. That's lovely. Yeah, and I no notice the reflectors are already fitted oh in there. 20 inch by yeah. four, yeah. PSI, 20 PSI. 20. So that's yeah. quite low, isn't it? That's good though. It's a yeah. lovely little tyre. What else have we got is this? 
He's keeping you tight. Lay it down. Yeah. I won't try and lift it out like I tried no. last time. <laughs> Give yourself a hernia. Yeah. 30 kilograms worth. Okay, don't think we're attached to the box. Take that one off. Nothing this and front is there. Yeah, we'll take that out in one. Right, lay it flat. Get it so you can see it. Pull it back a bit. All right. And out we go. Almost. Lovely. There we go. Bring that over here a sec. You stay. Get rid of the box. That's a lovely colour. Yeah, I quite like that colour. Yeah, it's very nice. A good finish as well. Yeah. It's like a matte. And these are like a pale. Yeah. I like that a lot. Yeah. Straight away you can see the rear suspension. Yeah. Start taking this off. It's pretty well packaged by the Oh, it's very it. well packaged. Yeah. That is yeah. really good. We'll leave that for now actually. Handlebars Handle bars wrapped in up here. Separately. Cable tied again. It's good. I mean, obviously these have been shipped halfway across the world, so you do need a decent packaging. 100%. Okay, we've got our light there as well. It's off. You are, I can see why you didn't want to, Jenny didn't want us to do it in the kitchen now. No. <laughs> <laughs> okay, we've got the rear mud guard. Well, the rear mud guard's already fitted, which is a big bonus. That is good. It's such a chunky looking thing, isn't it? Yeah. I love the look of these fat bikes because yeah. it's compact, yeah. but it's chunky. Let's see the frame. It's the nice part. Ah, lovely. Excellent. That is a lovely looking frame. Get this side off. Right, whilst we're doing the rest of it, do you want to get the battery out and we'll get that on charge? Yeah. Good idea. So there should be a key for it somewhere, shouldn't We're coming professionals. Right, so this time I'm going to guess that it's on the handlebar. <laughs> and look at that. Didn't just see that and pretend I knew. <laughs> <laughs> but that's a good idea, get that charged. And we'll take the packaging off it as well. So, with this one, one. again similar to the other, put it in, turn, and that'll come out now. That's released, he says. Put it in. There you go. That's it. Full turn. All right. Let's get that yeah. on charge then. Let's get this off. It's a, what what it, size it's, is it? It's a fair weight, isn't it? Yeah, it's a fair weight. It's quite oh, yeah. small though, isn't it? It's good. Yeah, quite, quite compact. Oh, look, it's got a little, uh, a little level thing, is oh, it? Yeah. Can't press that. Is that on? Is it? Oh, oh, there you go. Yeah, a little RGB. Just tell you if, where you are on your charge. Yeah. Okay. So it's got a bit of charge. There, don't, it? He wants to fall, so I'm going to put. Yeah. The wheel on in a sec. Okay, I'll just go and get this on charge. <laughs> okay. We on. Put this over here. And I'll put the front wheel on now. Yeah, so it's not a quick release, so it's quite a. Uh, what's the word I'm looking for? It's actually stronger than a quick release. Yeah. Where's that spanner? I bet you that's the same size. Let's check. Is that the right size? Oh, it is. So 15 mil spanner. Exactly. Why not? So slide this in, then we can get the bike actually sitting up. Good point. Okay, this is a little uh, bonus stop the disc brake from closing on you yeah. so when you do this it's not hard to do keep you out the way slide you in it's not these washers is it it is as well isn't it i'm supposed yeah. to put the washers on oh that was it so take your washers off first yeah. and your washers go on with the bolt not yeah. before yeah. the bolt oh okay. <laughs> <They're not laughs> thank you and don't lose your bolts either <laughs> 
<laughs> See, we did that, so you don't have to. <laughs> it is a lovely colour. Yeah. I love the, you know, the compactness of the frame. Yeah. Like how fat and chunky it is. Yeah. yeah. It's like a chunky, but the bike itself it's a mini is. SUV. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. I love it. Okay. Nice big seat as well, straight off the bat. Comfy seat. Yeah, it's actually got some. Breathable. Yeah. This is a good rack, just from the look of it. It's solid. Yeah. That's on as well. Don't need to. Well. Yeah. Don't need to do that. Don't need to put the rack on. It's already on. Take that lovely light off. Light. There's a brake light on that as well. I assume that will light up with the front when we yeah. spin the front one round. Look, they've put that, took that in in packaging. So oh, we'll right. spin that round. Get these handlebars on first. Two bolts. Loosen these two bolts. That's tighten. No, the other way. Oh, that's upside down. Oh, yeah. And now, get these nice and loose. I assume this is going to spin round. Yeah. Notice you've obviously got the compression there and that the, you can lock it off as well. There you go. Turns round. That's it. Get that nice and straight and retighten it. Yeah. And you can put our handlebars back on. Run that round, just going to tighten it now. Make sure it's nice and tight. Yeah, so I'm getting pretty excited about this. Good. Will it be your first, f other than the other one we tested, fat bike experience? Yeah. Yeah, we want second only fat bike experience. <laughs> first to I own. This, this rack here. <laughs> You've taken your, it off on your bike, haven't you? So. Yeah. But, for, uh, for me, yeah. carrying stuff, Yeah. I, I'm not really carrying much, but for most, I think it's a great... Uh, thing to have because yeah. you know you just especially with the dogs <laughs> yeah you want to put them on the back yeah well, that's what i was thinking you almost like, put a crate on the back of it you could put a toolbox yeah uh or shopping shopping that's a good one beer parcels beer <laughs> <laughs> take anything to you know be posted yeah within range so it comes with a little uh past that uh thank you Clip. So it comes with a little guide yeah. so that you can actually line up the handlebars perfectly. They don't all come with this. Right, he looks for his bolt. Get one in. Are you in? So you've got your plus sign that's perfectly in the middle. Yeah, and then so you've got target, your really, numbers yeah. so you can have it maybe oh. raised up down down yeah i'd always say there's good yeah the bars are kind of facing towards you so you're not leaning out but again when you sit on it we'll know yeah obviously you've got slightly longer arms you might want it further forward <laughs> exactly oh i wonder, I wonder what, what that is, is. Yeah. see i know what that is straight away yeah so that is when you add your thumb throttle oh right you'll okay. connect it there Right, gotcha. It's a good protecting sleeve actually that comes yeah, with. Yeah. Keeps them all tidy. Uh I'm sure you'll mention about how if you want to reduce uh sorry increase, un increase the speed on un unlimit it. Yeah. Uh you can find on their website how to do that. They actually say on the website, yeah, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, they give you a little video oh, right, and everything. Okay. Which is good. Some of the controls here, we've got the Shimano. Uh, shifter there. Shimano Alva 7 speed. 7 speed gears and it's got 5 levels of power assistance as five well. 5 levels of power assistance. Yeah. Where are my snips? See, I have been reading. <laughs> <laughs> I love looking at them. Uh, all the specs first, getting excited about them. Yeah. The way it comes packaged it's very quick and easy to build. It really is. Get you on nice. Alright, you're on. So I noticed here on the forks, now this is a you know, this shows a good quality fork. It's like a uh, a washer that you move up and down. Now you put it there. Yeah. And when you 
sit on the bike yeah this will show you your level of compression okay so that you could you know say oh that's a bit too much or yeah you know if it was coming up all the way here you'd say that was well too much if it's only oh. really moved there it's too hard okay yeah, i've got one on my uh mountain bike yeah so you'd be able to use that as like a guide then a guide so then you can how, adjust it here exactly to know how much okay. compression you're getting clever I haven't got one on on this but i imagine there's not as much play in that as this so. no no I don't think it's got a, an adjustment on that one anyway has it no there doesn't seem to be any dampening or anything so no. that must just be preset uh i wonder when if it's serviceable might just be come as it is We'll see how much it compresses when you sit yeah, on it. Yeah. There isn't really anything else, is there? I'm looking no. now thinking no, no. there's nothing else that needs going on. No, you've done the light. Yeah. Just sw swivel that round. That was just spun just the mug round. Guard at the front. Then. Oh, the mug guard. <laughs> oh, I've done it again, look. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> light first. Yeah. I do it every time now. <laughs> okay. <laughs> stuff. okay. Right, okay. That's it, really. I'll show you that because that was a little bit awkward. Again, it probably says in the instructions, doesn't it? Yeah. So Quite, yeah. And we put the, like, the bike bracket inside that, but it does sort of squash it up a bit, so. Unless there were any, can't have been any spaces or anything, because it's not really long enough. Well, to be fair, it doesn't actually tell you on here. No. Just for a heads up for anyone else who's putting on the front fender. Yeah. Just make sure you put your light fitting between inside, the yeah, yeah inside the bracket yeah uh, it makes up the distance then yeah. not trying to squish it yourself still yeah. great instructions though yeah tell you what should we try have a go with the uh battery uh well, uh, well what was i going to say the pump. pump pump up your tires see what they're on now yeah we'll see how this pump works actually got actually got two presta and strider yeah. valves yeah thank you couldn't think what they were called <sighs> It's really a keep, it's that way, isn't it? Yeah. It's really keep you going one, isn't it? Yeah. Get you on the road. No idea what there's a set at. I don't think the human hand can even get close to 20. No. So. Now, obviously you need to have your feet yeah here somewhere you don't you yeah you want to be able to have a slight bend in your knees when riding but be able to still get your feet on the floor anywhere in between is good still a bit low that's an adjustable seat so you can do that on the go you can adjust it with that let's try it now yeah that's about right i'm just about got my toes almost flat it's probably a little yeah. bit low and your leg put your uh yeah pedal at its widest point yeah that's good yeah you can go higher but you don't have yeah. to it's all preference no it's probably when you're getting used to it it's probably best a little bit lower but i think i'd go a little bit higher it's got a fraction higher that's it excellent it's got some really good cushion on that seat i've just noticed it's like uh like oh, its own there's, there's suspension there's springs in yeah. there isn't there yeah oh that's good it's good as well as a very yeah let's try the handlebars now yeah actually not bad because it makes you sit fairly upright yeah it's a good riding position it's yeah. like uh you're not too far over the bars no but your back's got a bit of an arch to it still yeah you happy with that yeah no i think it's good and of course if you wanted to that's just adjustable there you yeah. want to do that I'll, i might have a little play with it but initially that's pretty good should we stick the battery in yep oh yeah it's the most exciting part Should right around. that way yeah and i think the key gives it yep yeah, there you go a twist to lock oh, lock it right turn it on then okay <laughs> You turn it on. How do I make this go uh, brighter, sir? Just tap it. Ah, okay. Uh, how do you turn it on? That's a good point. How do you turn it on? What's <laughs> <laughs> that there? Is that a charging point? Oh, no, actually. What is that? Is that. Uh, it must be so you can charge it. I'll charge go. it without taking the battery out. I okay. should probably show that, shouldn't I? Yeah. 
we found this port here. Yeah, where you so can it is a battery port, isn't it? So you charge, can charge it, it on the go instead yeah. of taking the battery out. We're just yeah. trying to figure out how to turn on the bike now. <laughs> Instructions? Uh, yeah, go on. <laughs> <laughs> There's nothing obvious here on the handlebars as of you. We've got a horn, a light, up and down selector, gear selector, yeah, I wonder. That's just our assembly. We need yeah, to. Yeah. We we need a uh, a dummy proof, don't we? Of how to turn it on. Oh, come here. There was another little manual, wasn't there? Wonder if it's there. Uh, Is it in the battery thing? Charger port, bolt lock. Oh, oh no, that's not it. <laughs> <laughs> we will find out how. What about this? This is our last <laughs> last ditch last attempt now. <laughs> uh, that's connecting the charger. Okay. Oh, okay. So we're just going to have to figure it out. A little bit of uh, research was required here <laughs> to figure out how to turn it on. There's actually a button under here. There. Does it hold it? Yeah, there you go. It's coming on now. That's your on button. Oh, wow. Well, that is a good display. Yeah, so Colour. presumably you can go. Oh, yeah, there you go. The power assistance off one, two, three, four, five, and that's those buttons five. there using the up and down arrows. So you go up and down, e eco or off. Okay, off being it's just a normal bike. Yeah, okay, it's got speed in kilometers, so there must be a way of adjusting that, I'd imagine. Yeah, yeah, 78% battery that should do us. Yep, definitely. Uh, what's our horn sound like? Do you need to know? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and what do the lights look like? I'll see if I can. So. Is that on? Not yet. Is this one? Let's hold it or something. Yeah. Oh, oh no, I don't need Here to hold go. it. It's just press one, it. One press, press it once. Oh, and this comes on yeah, bright that, as well. There is, a, is there a brake? Yeah, there you go. Yeah. So you've got just like a car again. Yeah. Okay. Excellent. When you're pressing, you got a brake light. Oh, excellent. Well, I'm like a little kid at, a, at Christmas, eh? I know. I bet you are. Yeah. Excellent. It's a lovely bike. And I like the colour as well. Yeah. But yeah, it suits you. It's like your other one, but just... Bigger. Yeah. Yeah. Let's try it out. Oh, I'll tell you what. Helps if you put the stand away. Can hear it. <laughs> yeah. Hydraulic brakes as Hydraulic well. Hydraulic brakes, yeah. Hydraulic disc. It's what I'm used to with a mountain bike. Yeah. I feel much more, I don't know, secure. Yeah. See, I'm <laughs> it's a lot more stop and power, isn't it? Yeah. The little uh, stand as well, that's great. You can just freehand it like that. Yeah, well impressed with that. I'm going to get my helmet. I brought mine this time. Yeah. <laughs> 23, 23 kilometres. Liam's disappeared in the distance. So there's a new model from Cy Russia, the Komoda. It's a step through, fat tyre, e-bike with full suspension. Ideal for people with limited mobility or just easier to get on and off. The website shows it's selling at £1,699. It's normally £2,099. An extra battery is £549 and both together are 2248. As sold in the UK, it's limited to 250 watts by law. There is a throttle kit included, but it's illegal to use on road. But it is a 1000 watt peak motor. And so no, uh, no doubt it can be unlocked and unleashed, but remember you'll be illegal on the road. The battery is a 48 volt, 14 amp hour. It's limited to 25 kilometers per hour or 15.5 miles an hour. It's got a seven speed Shimano with five levels of power assist. Zoom hydraulic brakes. Its max load is 150 kilos and the claimed range is 50 miles. It's suitable for people from around five foot one to six foot two. Uh, it includes the charger and the toolkit. There's a two year warranty. Uh, dimensions uh, for the wheels are 20 inch by four inch. 
The max height of the bike to the handlebars is 45.7 inches. The max length is 68.3 inches. The step through is 15.2 inches. The seat goes from 32.3 inches to 41.5 inches and the handlebars are 20 inch handlebars. Yeah. <laughs> Still have to pedal. Yeah. <laughs> no, it's really good. Yeah. I think I need the seat a bit higher, but. Yep. Yeah. You're good with the uh, handlebars and stem. Possibly back a bit. A bit back a bit. Yeah. But yeah, no, it's good. I really feel the suspension. Yeah. You also think. I think it it probably could live with more power as well. Yeah. Yeah. Looks really good. Try out your tyres. Bum bum. Test the suspension. <laughs> the only trouble with not having a throttle. Yep. Is you get you if you've got a throttle, you get used to just sort of being able to move off without pedalling. Yeah. So Hills, climbing, you don't have to pedal. Yeah, I suppose you get used to it. Yeah. But uh, definitely, oh, definitely different. Of course, I forgot your other one had one. Yeah, yeah. It still has. Yeah, yeah, that's a good point. Yeah, see you in a minute. It's a good climb for it in the sand. You know, just watch yourself down here. Yeah, so the problem with not having a throttle is if you stop, it's difficult to get going again. Yeah. Especially in sand. I find if I put mine in gear five. Yeah. And in gear seven. Yeah. So speed five, speed yeah. assist five, right. gear seven. Yeah. And I push down. Yeah. That's the that closest I can get to having yeah. a throttle. A throttle, yeah. 